Madam Chair, can we do um, number five of the marriage request before we do the certificate of the president? Okay. 021 02. All right. So for those in the audience, we'll be looking at agenda item number five. We'll be hearing the variance ahead of item, agenda item number four. Okay. Thank you, Madam Chair. Um, both of these um, go hand in hand with each other. The variance for 2021-01 and the certificate of appropriateness, appropriateness 2021-02. Um, this property is the applicant is Elise Thompson on behalf of Bud Billboards and the owner is Roger Bud Jr. Location is 1207 Bay Tree Road. It's in our community commercial downtown district. The request for the variance is to convert um, billboards to multiple message signs. This property is also where the Waffle House is located. Um, where the actual sign is, it's about 436 square feet that they have parceled out for the sign. Um, the main motivation behind this request is to allow for the conversion of two existing billboards to be replaced as two multiple message signs. Um, in our ordinance, no multiple message sign, sign Permit shall be approved or issued until the applicant shall obtain the approval by an owner and the removal of at least two then existing billboards within the city limits. There are currently four billboards on this sign. There are two back-to-back 10x30 -back signs and two 10x10 signs that are below the 10x30 signs. Um, <clears throat> no multiple message signs shall be located within a thousand feet of any pre-existing multiple message sign located outside the city limits such signs is visible from an advantage point five feet above the ground level of such proposed sign within the city limits. There are two existing signs that are located um, in this proximity to the proposed sign. Zagaboo's is 275 feet away and Smooth's is 568 feet away with their multiple measure signs. Uh, as we discussed last week, I was waiting to hear from the current property or from the applicant. Um, requesting if they were willing to remove those two smaller signs in lieu of, um, in order to get the two uh, multiple message signs, I have not heard from them at all. Um, so staff's recommendation is staff is not supportive of and denies the proposed barriers request to convert two billboards to multiple message signs as it does not coincide with the city's current development standards for multiple message signs in the city of Riverton. So initially what you're saying is in order to approve the two multiple message signs, they need to remove the two smaller signs. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Two, two billboards within Rickerson. Right. So they necessarily have to be those. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thompson twice about it when she first came in and we did our um, pre-application meeting I explained to her about the two signs coming down and she took that information back to the owner and they wanted to still do it this way with leaving the four signs and then I made contact with her again. Voting against, and that one 